Hey guys, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. And you know, we were just we just wrapped up the Brotherhood's quest line when we, when we left off. Finally, uh, we got power armor training. I just wanted to sleep for the for the health. I forgot to do that. Uh, please move. Thank you. So now we've pretty much have taken care Ethan, of Veronica. I thank you for helping me out. I'm sorry that things didn't go like I'd hoped. But at least I got the chance to try. At least I know for sure that there was nothing I could do. Ah, this shit just hurts me, man. It just breaks my heart that uh, that it fucked her over. You know what are you gonna do? Super Drake. Oh yeah, that? that was also. Uh, this right here is a romance dialogue that I forgot. I just clicked it because it was like revealed. I just the moment I saw Let's Get Going, that's when I realized what it was. I thought it was like unlocked from finishing her. I mean, it is unlocked like that. But basically, if you have a female courier, you can uh, get it on with Veronica because she is a lesbian. So there is that. If you have that mod, at least. I think she doesn't really have anything new to talk about, though, other than, you know, stuff that you can ask every companion. This stuff don't really matter. I, I like the lore stuff and... You know, we pretty much exhausted most of it with her. Maybe, maybe there might be. What do you want? Yeah, this is all like lore stuff. I know sometimes I sound like I don't. I know, but there's something that still rings true to me about our code. There's an honor to it. We're protecting people, even if it's from themselves. It's a good cause. We just lose sight of the big picture sometimes. Treat all our practices with the same sacredness. Yeah, it could certainly be like that. Let's. Yeah, alright, so... That's that's it for Veronica, you know, uh... Just like... Just how it goes with usually the RPGs, you know, once you do their shit, they're, they're kinda done, you know, they're just around. Um, the power fist is looking fire as usual, but... The th well, she's not 100% done, there is still more to Veronica, it's just for now she's done. We can't do too much with her right now. We have to we have to complete that money now to to continue her story. And at this point I guess we need to go to Lucky Thirty Eight to swap her out for Cass real quick because or you know what? No. Because we still gotta do birds of a feather. And Cass cannot go into the Silver Rush without getting bodied, basically. So, so we, you know, or at least do most of Hello? Birds of a Feather. Sub Giles. Was, it wasn't Giles, right? That, that wanted that shit? No. So, let's go check this dude out. See if. Is that another cave? Let's go look. But yeah, Veronica, you know, unfortunately her story does not end. Uh... Huh. another another entrance oh shit the ants are here I'm gonna let these guys take the ants down I'll save my ammo for people that give it to me let's see what do we got going on here radioactive oh this is for the quest <laughs> yeah so there's um there's two of those. There's the first one we just picked up with the radioactive cache, and then the other one is where that, remember a couple episodes back, we ran into that con, and he got clapped, and then I loaded the save because I felt bad. Yeah. We're going to go get that right now. But... I myself over here. Uh, if there was anything good to pick up, I couldn't do it. They need everything they've got. Yeah, uh, I would appreciate it if you don't try to steal from refugees, Willow. <laughs> Come on, Willow. Don't be like that. Yeah, but at least, you know, we got our T-51B. It's not faction armor, thankfully. Because I believe if you take it off a Brotherhood member, if you buy... I don't know if, if, if you buy it from their store if it's faction armor. But but taking it off a member, you, you'll get the faction variant. And I'm, I'm not for faction armor at all in this game. Like, I only want to use it when I have to. You know, like, if like those missions where you got to, like, infiltrate and shit. But other than that... I, I don't, I'm not for it, because it, well, all it does is make everyone neutral towards you, so if you have good, even the faction that you're 
even if you're on good terms with the faction you're pretending to be, they'll go neutral on you too when you wear that armor. So, no need. It, it's it's only good for if you're really vilified with with whoever you're trying to deal with. And uh, yeah, the thing with Veronica now is we when we go to dead money. And even Old World Blues might give us some dialogue for her because of Elijah, but Elijah is a, is a final key in anything left we, that we could do with Veronica. Unfortunately, uh, there's somebody that Veronica knows, and we meet in Dead Money, and we in the vanilla game, you can never bring this up to her, which is, again, one of those things like, that. no, this had to have been like a mistake. Like This is... You know, but thankfully, there's a mod that not only lets us bring that person back as a companion, but you can even take them on together at the same time, and they will be like, "Holy shit, it's you!" You know, and it's it's a nice, it's like the nicest, it's, that's like the best good ending we're gonna get for Veronica, cause you know she kind of gets fucked. And to this day, I I still hope that somebody eventually will make a mod one day that's like, you know, um. That what it does is it, it allows Veronica to become elder or something because she would be a great elder. She really would. She's she's not a bad person at all. And um you know, she would do good for the brotherhood. She wouldn't leave them to die. Her she would reform them, no doubt. She would definitely reform them. Who are you? How did you find this place? Refugee camp. Is that what they're calling it? Good old NCR. They can whitewash anything. Let me tell you something. That refugee camp, it's built on the blood and tears of my people. Nobody likes to talk about it, but I remember. I know that, but what else can I do? Uh, go home. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe you're right. Maybe three years is vengeance enough. Thank you for helping me see that. Here, this will unlock the supply caches we left in caves around these mountains. You might get some use. Bro, my man's is out here killing civilians for three years, bro. What? Ugh. You fucking bugging, bro. Bugging for real. Giles, where you at? You're back. Any progress on saving our skins? We do have some spare radex in the supply tent. That might work. Thank you. You did? Who was it? Any information you could give me would be a big help for my reports. Really? Well, this canyon used to be a great con stronghold. I suppose that Come explains here. why he was able to evade us so easily. Oh, level up. Let's fucking go. About three years ago, NCR's first recon launched an attack on the con encampment here. There was a communication mix-up that resulted in some non-combatants being killed. I guess he was still bitter about it. It was a tragic mistake, but we've done all we can to make amends. We provided medical aid to the wounded, all the wounded, and permitted the cons to resettle at Red Rock Canyon. I don't know how you did it, but thank you. At this point, I'll take anything you can give me. We need more troops, fresh supplies, and medical relief. Okay, but make it quick. I'm very busy here. Uh, it's a oh, excuse call. me, guys. This camp is in bad shape, and if we don't get relief soon, I don't know what will happen. Where did you get this? You know what? It doesn't even matter. It doesn't completely solve our problems, but it goes a long way. Anytime. Yay! 23. Come on. Give me that. Oh, let's go 50 sneak. We're, we're getting... Did we get Sandman yet? No. I think it's 60. <laughs> Damn it, Nappa. Okay. Let's see. What are we... Rapid reload is pretty useful, actually. I'm not gonna lie. Especially if you're using the cowboy weapons, you know, like uh, any anything that and it forces you to load bullets and not and not a clip. Let's see, what are we doing? Dead belly. I mean, we do have. 
I haven't. I mean, it wouldn't hurt to get this right now. I do have a riot shotgun now. That's pretty much going to be our shotgun for the rest of the game. There is no terrible shotgun in this game, unfortunately, boys. <laughs> I don't. There, I don't even think there is any combat shotguns in this game. I don't. Never seen it. They only have like you know them classic shotgun looking shits, and the riot shotguns really the only tactical shotgun I've seen really. Grunt. Yeah, yeah, we're definitely gonna want to use grunt. Definitely, we we were using a an assault carbine right now. So 25% more damage, yes sir. Okay, so Giles, we're done here. We don't have the medical expertise to help the guy in the tent right now, so so we'll just we'll just leave that alone for now. It doesn't hurt to go deliver this package now. Wait, it was right there. That's how close it was. Damn, we could do that shit way earlier. <laughs> Let's see. <clears throat> what do you got going on here? I don't even see the person who I'm supposed to give this shit to. <laughs> they're like, they're like hidden somewhere. Up oh, there, <laughs> my man's is crouching. He's like, I don't want nobody to see. Bro, why are you running away? Wait. Oh, somebody's hostile. That's what's scaring you? That golden gecko? Are you the Van Graaff Cemetery? Do you have what we requested? We were told there would be no questions. <laughs> Who is Do you we? Have what we requested or not? I wasn't informed there was to be an exchange on my part. What are you talking about? Such a thing is possible. I've been out in the field for some time. Fine. This should cover your grievance. Now the package, if you will. Huh. Then our business is concluded. Tell your superiors that we will contact them shortly. Ooh, got any juicy gossip? <laughs> I grew up in a big family too. I have five brothers. We lived above ground, though. Yeah, <laughs> yo, I am crying. <laughs> nah, that got me weak. That got me weak as fuck. Oh my god, that was, that that was great. Yo, <laughs> that is shot. Yeah, I I am baffled. I am. That is hysterical. <laughs> Willow comparing the Brotherhood of Seal to her actual family really has me destroyed. Like, yo. <laughs> Puta madre, bro, for real. I, yo, I am, I am shot. I can't believe she, Willow just shot me in the chest with that. These guys always gotta whip the guns out when I pull up. God damn. Welcome back. Did you have news for me? Or are you just here for the guns? Actually, you know what? Before I do kill you, I should see what kind of shit you have for me. multi plus rifle. The fuck is that? Is that a shock of some sort? I don't remember using that. Oh yeah, this thing doesn't use ammo, right? Doesn't do much damage. I don't... Yeah, I don't think I ever really used it. Well... Uh, you've effectively managed to sell nothing that entices me. Nothing. Well, okay. Maybe the Gauss rifle. Okay, I'll take the Gauss rifle. That's, you know, it's a Gauss rifle. Like, <laughs> wait, and, it, and look how cheap it is. I mean, granted, you know, I'd rather, I, there's a location where we can get a unique Gauss rifle, I think, or, oh, no. No, I don't know if we could even get it. It might have been replaced. Cause uh, wild wasteland perk. Yeah, I think it replaces that to get an alien uh, 
what do you call it? An alien pla an alien plasma uh shit, you know what I'm talking about. Alien pistol. Whoa, you got a lot of micro. I will you know, liberate that from you. I won't be paying in caps today though. I uh, I heard you take guns. <laughs> Let's see. The sniper rifle will actually pay off completely. Yeah, it will pay it off and then uh, and then some. I'm I would be Yeah. Hmm. I wonder, is there anything I could do to change that? I mean, I don't really use pulse slugs though. Uh, should I just buy it? Yeah, why not? We just want to keep it slightly above. Yeah. We'll live with that. Better yet. Hold on a second. Nah. You could have this repeater. I don't... I don't... I don't know what the fuck we're gonna do with that shit. I literally just gave her the repeater, like, yo, just take this off my hands. That plasmus rifle, though, I feel like, like, what is that, a shotgun? I, f I don't remember using that. It's all good, we have, a we already have, like, a superior Hello. item. We got Welcome the Q38 back. or whatever it's called. For me, or are you just here for the guns? And don't leave me in. Good, good. Here's your payment. If you'll excuse me, I have some thinking to do. Oh, Jean Baptiste was talking about a matter earlier that he needs help with. I volunteered you. See him for the details. Sure. Ah, just the person I was looking for. Your name came up in a discussion we had recently. My sister is very impressed with you so far, but I'm not. I don't think you have what it takes to work for this family. Luckily for you, I'm going to give you a chance to prove me wrong. What do you say? Want to make some real money? No, no, no. That's not... All right, you butthole. All right, then. If we're going to work together, there's only one thing you need to know about me. I like things simple. Recently, Glory negotiated a deal between us and a big-time player. We're talking more caps than you've probably seen a lifetime. Your part in this is simple. To finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. There it is. Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's some fancy shit, right? Don't know what her mother was thinking with a name like that. But this girl and I, we need to have a discussion. Find her. Bring her here so I can talk to her one-on-one. -on -one. Find her, bring her back here so we can talk. Needless to say, there's some good money in it for you. Yep, so at this point, you have two options, really. Well, no, you still got the, the non-violent option, but we've, we've decided not to go that route already, haven't we, guys? So, the reality is, well, I mean, yeah, you could always probably do the non-violent action of getting... Uh, you know, going to the, they have a, what do you call that shit? They have a terminal in the back. Gotta hack it. It gives you some juicy info that you give to the NCR and they can arrest to Gloria. Same thing with Alice McCaffrey. She has some juicy info in a safe. Looking to lose a and, uh, class, puts huh? her down. And I've done it that way. It's definitely a good way to do this quest without having to deal with, uh, you know, assassinating. Because it is, I will say that it's not exactly the easiest things to do. Where to, partner? Let's see, hold on. Presidential suite. Because you got two things here. You got Alice McCaffrey, who is constantly surrounded by me all day. Like, everybody is just around her. She's rarely alone. So, it's just harder to take her out, especially if you don't have a silenced weapon. Like, it's just that much harder to do if you don't have silenced weapons, and some people never run into them. I remember I played New Vegas entirely once, and I never used one. I mean, I've seen the Silence 22R, like, you know, on the menu to buy it, but did I get it? Nah, because I figured I didn't need it. Ready to leave yet? 
Aside from the TV face robots, the dust, and the old man smell in every room, nothing. It's a paradise. Christ. This place has the old world blues about it. Everything in here feels like it should have passed on a long time ago. Hell, it's like wow. Vegas is right outside. It's pretty morbid. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm looking to leave whenever you're ready. Holy shit. God damn. Meanwhile, everybody else is like, yo, this place is fire. Could drink booze all day in this high roller suite. Wait. Oh, shit. Yeah, I totally forgot about this. Why not? We got the caps for it. Yeah, man. And, uh... That's about it. We're, we're, we're pretty much done here. Glad I left the... Where to, partner? We got, we got, uh, Cass, and it's time to be out. Casino floor. No, we're not gonna kill her. If anyone's out here like, holy shit, bro, you gonna, you gonna send Cass off? Alright, let's hit the Nah, we're gonna, we're gonna do the old Something switcheroo. Something to say to me, other... <laughs> this is fucked up. I'm already. Yeah, I don't know if that changes anything, but we're just gonna load it anyways. Something to say to me? That's about it. So, yeah, so pretty much you take her over to Freeside, and then, um, you know, the guys can, he'll talk to her and then kill her, and then I believe you do have a little bit more work with Come them. The I think they give you a little bit more work, if I remember. Weapons. I mean, he does say I got more work for you, so, probably not lying. Uh, I just never liked the Silver Rush. I feel like the way those two treat you off the bat is sort of like they're above you. Like, no matter what. And it's like, uh, you guys are are doing, you know, your weapon sellers. You're selling, you know, some of the best mm -hmm. weapons in the in the game. Fair enough. But, uh, but y'all, y'all not out here. <laughs> like, the boy is out here pushing NCR objectives and all this other crap. I'm going in. Like, I'm going to be Welcome stronger, back. so why, why are you trying to kill me? Jean-Baptiste had for you. I also forgot that the task is for John. As I live and breathe, Rose of Sharon Cassidy. Wait. I'm just gonna show you what happens. Hi, I'm John Baptiste, and you're about to stop being a pain in my ass. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, that was fun. Anyway, if this thing goes down, and don't think I forgot your pay. That's all you get for killing Cass, bro? God damn. <laughs> Yo, that is fucking morbid, bro. Holy shit. Nah, yeah, but they're just so pretentious, man. Cause they sell, just because they sell energy yeah. weapons. It's like, bro, energy weapons aren't even that, like, hype. AMR is nutting on everything in this room. Okay. <laughs> like relax but we're, we're gonna we're gonna clap these guys around this is uh, gonna be a bit of a fight you know you got plaza rifles up this shit it's gonna be fun so we've got to make sure we're prepared let's see what what weapon shall I use for this so it's a special day not long we it's not often we get this hmm <laughs> sleepy time would be bussin it would but is it time for the shoddy? I don't know, let me see. Cowboy repeater. Yeah, maybe it's time for the cowboy repeater. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Look at that, I already got at least 100 rounds. I like using this thing, it's kind of fun. Or... Hmm, do I kind of do want to use a riot shotgun though? Let's do the shotgun. Come on, we never get to do the shotgun. This would be like a, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be litty. But the Silver Rush Clappening will be happening on the next time.
of Dragon Ball Z.